morning everybody it's Sunday and Critley is at work and it's that EKU intensive theater camp that she's doing so she's gonna be there all day I'm heading up to Winchester to go visit family and along the way I'm also bringing some Dungeons and Dragons books that my little sister wants to borrow her and her friends are apparently going to have some D&D sessions so go nerds this is going to be interesting. Um, hopefully she may do a little bit of a recording. Kind of doubt it because the first D&D &D sessions you ever have are kind of awkward and really, really funny. So I don't know if she'll actually ever record anything that she does D&D &D wise. But it'll be interesting. Um, so I'm bringing those up there so that she can borrow them and have fun with them. Beyond that, just going to have some good time visiting family and then I'm going to have to head off to work afterwards. So, it's going to be, eh, as far as I know, a slow day. So, see y'all later. <laughs> Camp has begun. I got here to the school at about 10.30 this morning. And helped get set up for registration. We got all the paperwork and binders downstairs for the kids for them to pick up when they got to the school and um, stuff for the parents to sign for behavior and all that sort of thing. I took the registration up for all the dual credit kids. For those of you who don't know, dual credit is when a camp student or high school student during the regular semester, they take a class while they're still in high school or in this case they're taking the camp class. Um, and that will count as a college class. It will count, in this case, as Acting 1. So I took all their information. Then at 1.30, it was time for my lunch break, so I headed out for lunch. Now it is 2.21, so I'll be going back in there in just a little bit. And I think regular registration will open up then, so I'll be dealing with those parents and those children. Um... Technically, I get off work at 5.30 today, so I could go home, but Scott work tonight, will so be, um, I may go to Lexington with the group um, from the camp and see the show that Alana, the director of the theater department that she's in, um, I've never gotten to see the, this particular theater in Lexington, and... I think it would be kind of cool. I know they're doing the show Twelfth Night. I've never got to see that show in person. I've read the, the play, but I've never got to see it in person. So I may do that. I don't know. It just depends on how tired I am after I get out of here. Um, but we'll see. Hey, guys. Well, I'm back in Richmond now. Um, a little bit early for clocking in at work. I've got about another 15 minutes before I have to. So I'm just gonna sit out here in the truck and kind of relax. Traffic on 75 heading north, horrible. It is deadlocked. I don't know what in the world's going on. If y'all know what it is, post it in the comments down below if you so choose. Because I'm just kind of curious what in the world was going on for all that traffic. I mean, there was nothing moving. I'm glad I was heading south. Um, visit with family in Winchester went pretty well. Sydney was geeking out over the Howl's Moving Castle art concept book that I got yesterday. She was having fun practicing drawing and looking at it and reading the notes and the makings of the movie. The movie is called Howl's Moving Castle, directed and um, screenplay written by Hayao Miyazaki of Studio Ghibli. If you haven't seen it, I recommend it. It's really good. I enjoy it quite a lot. It's one of Sydney's favorite movies. It's one I really like a whole lot as well, but I like anything made by Studio Ghibli, so that's not a surprise. So, I'm studying up on it right now, and Sydney's having fun practicing with the photos that she took. Beyond that, like I said, visit with family went well. Now, I guess I gotta go into work here soon, so I'm just gonna cool it, then go clock in and spend the rest of my day. I think Critley is still at work. I don't think she actually clocks out for another hour. Unless she's going to go see that play that um, one of her professors is doing. She may do that today too. 
So we'll have to see. Hey guys. Well, I'm on my 30 minute meal from work right now. Oh, glad I was able to take it. Store's a bit busy tonight. It's Sunday, and it's not horrible once it hits this point. It's about 8.42 now. The problem is, we're shorthanded again today. So, I'm taking care of pet department, hardware, home, probably the center aisle later. But right now, we're backed up on returns because of the call-ins we've had this week. So, I've been working on those a whole lot. Uh, first quarter of work today was really easy because we're shorthanded. There was barely anyone here to cover for breaks, so I covered 15-minute breaks, training programs, and everything else that needed to be done for a guy that was working over in the garden center today. So I spent like the first hour and a half just watching garden center as it rained a little bit. As long as the rain didn't anyway. Like, but pretty simple. I didn't really have to do a whole lot because he had already gotten everything else done out there and it was so warm that we barely had a customer come out there to look at plants. So I just was basically standing around. So that's an easy eight bucks an hour. Uh, let's see. Rest of the tonight probably should be simple. At least I hope so.